Y'all, y'all already know what it is, man. It's your boy Jeff, aka Cool Boy Jeff, right here. That's the only place you can find the waves to wave it or Back again with another video right here. And today we're gonna talk about FBG Butter. Alright, he made some claims about Lil J uh be uh saying that he has AIDS, man. Um he's been having it for a little while now. And let's say that Lil J he responded back to what he said. Uh, shout out to Drill Time TV too for uh, putting this joint together, and I want to be able to do a reaction video to this joint, so be able to show my love and whatnot. So let's go ahead and get into this video. Like, comment, subscribe, hit that bell, stay updated on all videos to drop on this channel, so you won't miss a thing, and you'll be the first one to get it. And like always, let's go ahead and get to it. You heard me? Game. See what I'm saying? At least A's game. How many people y'all think he came home and gave A's to? Hmm. Shot the drill. I'm just letting you know how it is. It's kill time. Hit that like button for your boy. What's up, what it do? Drill time TV checking in once again. Oh, wait. Now why your boy Butter get off the flat and start spilling the beans? Hold on. Now Butter done told a shocking revelation. I know this had to be eating away at his soul for the long. Man, it's sad. Because we all been given a fair warning. And we seen the signs time after time. But I guess this just hit home for Butter. Because Lil' J done passed that shit off to two of his childhood friends. He said they still living and got a story to tell. We gon' get into that. Butter said when Lil' J came back this last time, man, he was, he was hitting everything moving. And because he a face out there in Chicago... He done damn near raw dog sudden out of every circle. Oh, don't act like you ain't see the way he is carrying himself in Cook County. <laughs> damn, we done caught you in 4K on the Geechee farm. Bloodbath was right. Now I'm recalling everything he said. He said, check them tickets, man, because he might got that damn thing. Mm -hmm. He told the guards one of them boys spit on him in PC and had it. Had what? That yeah, monkey. But for some reason, he ain't go <laughs> tell y'all that. So, he's, he mentioned something about a, a HIV or a disease. <laughs> He too crazy, yo, too good. I, I heard I was gay, I was told now. And it came on showing every piece of evidence. Going on up here with the situation. Yeah, he spit on me, he spit on me on the patio, acting crazy. Because his, his motherfucking punk girlfriend talking crazy to the dope. So he get to talk crazy, spitting on my fuck, so he damn, yeah, bro, too good. Well that's what motherfucker gonna say next. What are you gonna say next? Damn. <laughs> That's cold right there. You gotta have some cold proof for that, too, because of HIV. Come on now, man. You gotta try harder than that, man, too. I don't know. That they might be fight enough that. evidence yeah. to steal the deal. From you saying out your mouth that somebody spit on you with AIDS. The blood valve saying it's real live tickets floating around. That make you say, hmm. It seemed like homie coming from a genuine place and was really trying to warn the ladies of Lil J double life. But let me know what y'all think about the whole situation. Is it possible that we all been seeing things wrong or had something in our eye at the same time? Is this man saying he being framed and the ops just out to ruin his reputation? But yeah, let me know y'all thoughts down below. And don't forget to like this video, share it to your friends. And subscribe to the channel for more drill time updates. I'm gonna let Bloodbath take it from Shout here. Shout out DJ UTV. Let me clear this up right quick. I don't got nothing bad to say about Lil J or nothing like that. I don't got nothing against him. But if he out there acting like he wasn't in here fucking with transsexuals and protected custody and shit like that, then that's bogus. I want all the ladies to, like, I want all the ladies. To watch they self because there's a lot of females who be fucking around, you know. See, mm -hmm. bro, and them turned up. They want to have good times and have fun and shit like that. Watch out for Lil J, man, because he had papers floating around her. He was fucking with a transsexual named Brandon Arnold. Mm -hmm. Wow. With a transsexual named Brandon Arnold and a Dario, a Dario Smith. And if you Google them names, they'll pop up or whatever. And I can get the ticket numbers and shit like that so we can ask him to get those tickets and read what they say, sexual misconduct and shit like that. So, papers is going around that he got HIV gang. Damn. None of that shit. I'm trying to look out for my people out there. Damn. Damn, Lil' J. Yeah. Over here giving giving them people that 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 shit that they can't get rid of. What? Damn, Jiggy. 
Boy, getting jiggy for real. I had given people that ice spice. Shit. Cause that shit be spreading, and then it can get back to my family. I got sisters, all type of shit. Mm -hmm. I got brothers. I don't want that shit to spread back to them. You see what I'm saying? I see exactly what you're saying, gang. But do they see or is they trying to see it? And soon as Lil J touched down this last time, Mother said he got to spray in that thing like wildfire. And he know two people right now walking around with it, courtesy of the Cloud Lord. Shout out Cam Capone, cause I learned something today. Now I don't know why it took Butter so long to get the world this information, when in fact it could have possibly saved a life or two. But it is what it is, and I'm glad he getting the message out there now. HIV is involved, gang. See what I'm saying? At least AIDS, gang. And you know what he did? He came home, gang, and tried to f everybody. And he f half all them hoes, gang. Mm. Come on, bro. What about what about everybody else that's hanging around, gang? What well, the fuck? Y'all gotta really think about who he is, gang. He he's so big that he a f bitch in your inner crowd. Knowing that one of y'all gonna f and somebody gonna f somebody up. Mm. And that's how y'all get it. I'm telling y'all, shit, be real. Damn. Shit get real, bro. Damn. Like, I knew what the one agent who I'm talking about with Lil J, like, who can vouch that she already knew that shit wasn't no lie game. You feel me? Damn. China, Zaisha, looks us up behind it because she really believed that shit, shit. Damn. She really believed what he had to tell her outside of what her brother was telling her, Ben telling her. These are my shorties. When they ain't with Lil J and anybody ain't want them around, I had Zaisha, Jada, J all them around. I had all, everybody around, bro. We was always technically good at Jada. Bro, bro. That was my shorty, um, bro. When you saw Buddy, you saw Duddy. Um, B, and we was out there. Mm. Uh -huh. Oh, fuck that, but dog, though, that shit be, it's crazy, though. It's crazy, G. Motherfuckers be crazy. And now they got AIDS, huh? Damn. How many people y'all don't got, how many people y'all think he came home and got AIDS, too? That's crazy. Man, he's That's crazy. Man, Lil J pass out death sentences to the females, gang. <laughs> what part of the game is that? First of them ladies, man, it's an unfortunate situation. They were saying he had pneumonia when he jumped off that tear running from folk them. You know that's a little wow. complication. But you know Lil J, he always got something to say and he go deny it to the end. He want his fans to believe that the world just hating on him and the bloggers making this up as they go. But for real, for real, all he gotta do is trick y'all. Because Chicago already know what time it is. But let Lil J tell it, but all cap. Got out pool, you niggas. Now I will never get none of that shit. Niggas on front out in these streets on front now. Oh, you got HIV. <laughs> Y'all try to find any excuse, any way to ruin a black man that's out here trying to win. If I'm out here still winning, that shit don't. Y'all can make them rumors or whatever on phone now. That shit false, man. On Tuka, that shit real life false, and that's really like really niggas. Niggas really know. Niggas really saying this. It's like a crime. You you saying. Somebody come in the crime, that's a crime. He's out here doing that shit for real. You sick ass niggas doing that shit for real. Having that shit for mm. real. And don't tell them that shit not cool, man, on Tuka. That shit ain't cool on Fun Gray. So a motherfucker say I did that and stop that, man. And I'm bad as those I am going crazy on gang. Bad. I'm going crazy. Y'all tripping. That shit ain't gonna stop me, man. That you shit crazy. Stop me, man, on Tuka. Y'all gotta come better than that, man, on Fun Only thing that'll stop me is death. On Fun Them. What well, damn? Let me know what y'all think in the comments, man. The life and times of Lil' J getting treacherous. Y'all created a monster. They said Flea Johnson ain't got nothing on Deathstroke Jeff. But let me know what y'all think in the comments, man. And don't forget to like, comment, share, and subscribe. And hit that notification bell so I can keep you updated. Now, remind you, Butter said he got two females that can confirm this because they done caught it from him, right? And I'm going to keep my antennas up for that there. But until then, I catch you. Hey man, I just want to say this joint right here is crazy, and for the fact that Lil J, if he really do got aged allegedly, it's crazy for him to play it off like that, man, and for it to be easy spread like that, man, that joint is just crazy. But anywho, shout out to Drill Town TV, man, always love from here, here to there. Like, comment, subscribe, let me know what y'all think about the uh, about the video. All right, um, what y'all think? Y'all think Butter telling truth? I think Lil J telling the truth, y'all who lying. I mean, the facts is there. It's all there. I got to see what y'all opinion is. Facts over feelings, all right? So...
until next time, I'll see y'all. Y'all be safe out here. And please, don't be silly. Wrap your willy. Peace out.